Jacob Evan Freeman. I have been praying for you and for this moment since I was a little girl. Since our first day, I knew I was in for an adventure. Jades, wow, it's finally here, our wedding day. I've known since the very first day that you were the one, you. Over the past four years, you have grown to be my best friend, the first and last person I think about as the sun rises and sets. That very first day I met you, the Holy Spirit was whispering in my ear that you'd be my husband someday. That night in 2016, when you whispered your name, it was real, and I'll never lose that feeling in my heart. I know that you will be missing your dad up in heaven, and trust me, so will I. It was just one time I could tell him how much I love his Jada and promise him how much I'm going to take care of you. It's just always on my heart, and I can't believe how so very strong you are. I will never forget this day, and I cannot wait to tell our children, grandchildren, and great-grandchildren about it someday. We will tell them about the highs and the lows, the number of times we changed our plans, and how hard the enemy tried to stop this day from happening because he knew something so incredible was about to happen. I love you more than any words can ever explain, and I'll be seeing you soon. Well, Jades, this is it. The moment we have waited for us for so very long. Take a deep breath. Don't fall walking down the aisle. And please don't cry because it'll only make me cry harder. You're going to look so beautiful and I can't wait to see you. I love you forever, Jacob. From this moment, I, Jacob, take you, Jada, as my best friend for life. Hi, Jada, take you, Jacob, from the safe room. I promise to honor, encourage, encourage, and support you. And support you. I vow to help you live life. And always to love and care for you. And always to love and care for you. When our times seem difficult, I promise to stand by you. I promise to stand by you. I am thankful that God has made you just for me. With every beat of my heart, I will love you. I will love you. This is my solemn vow to you. This is my solemn vow to you. Take a few kisses. Kiss your wife. I introduce for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Jacob Freeman. Here they are, first time public, together, married, Mr. and Mrs. Freeman. But he's also so proud of the woman you've turned into be. He just beams, I know he does. And I'm so proud of you. And I'm so happy you chose my son. And I just love you and appreciate you. I lived with Jacob for two years during college, so I'd like to offer a bit of advice to treat him in much the same way that you would your students at school. Use small words so you don't confuse him. <laughs> Always perform retreats and be prepared to clean up messes and repeat yourself more than once. My first piece of advice is don't steal her clothes. She really doesn't like that. <laughs> and put your name on your food in the fridge. My advice is always be the first to apologize because we both know Jacob. 